To relieve border communities from overcrowded conditions, I bust migrants to sanctuary cities in other states. When Governor Greg Abbott announced his migrant busing program, he touted an ability to raise money from many concerned private citizens. But a new report released Friday by CNN shows that to date, only around $550,000 have been raised to send migrants to sanctuary cities like New York City, Chicago, and Washington, D.C. That's less than 1% of the roughly $150 million that's actually been spent on the operation. So it's very expensive to move people. The governor's office says the operation has moved more than 100,000 migrants. Public records state it costs about $1,500 to move each one, money that's being funded by taxpayers. There's some issues of humanitarian uh, concern, but um, I think at least for his home constituency, the argument would be something like this. It's $150 million well spent. Bob Stein, a political science expert at Rice University, says the majority of Texas taxpayers consider the migrant crisis a matter of public safety. What the governor is saying is we're not going to pay for it anymore. State records obtained by CNN shows the biggest donation made to Abbott's program was almost a million dollars, but the check bounced just months later. And according to data, that donor used a false name and disconnected their phone number. That wasn't the only discrepancy. I was more than surprised to find my name on that list. And given that I'm so diametrically opposed to anything that Governor Abbott stands for. Hendrik Voss, an immigrant from Germany now living in Washington, D.C., says he was listed on state data as a donor of $2,000. It looks like that part of that list is made up. Other journalists who have been digging into that list have found thousands of dollars that never uh, were donated. Stein adds, although the private funding for Abbott's initiative is less than expected, he can continue to rely on the state to fund his operation. He can get the state to pay for it. Um, why, why spend political capital on something like this if, in fact, you can use um, state revenues, executive authority? Thank you for watching. Please hit the subscribe button and get the latest news by downloading the CBS Austin News app.